The tests will be more challenging. They'll reflect the Common Core. So the passages that students will be asked to read will be more challenging than the kinds of things they've been asked to read in the past. They will be required to use evidence to support their arguments. They will be required to do multiple step math problems that will really test their uh, conceptual understanding in mathematics. So it is true that the tests will be more challenging because the common core standards are more challenging than our existing state standards. But again, we've been moving our curriculum since 2010 uh, towards the Common Core. It wouldn't have made any sense to have our assessments um, not reflect the curriculum that we're teaching. And so we've got to have a, a um, alignment between the assessments and the instruction. And as students are now engaged in Common Core instruction, we need to assess their performance against the Common Core, and it will inform educators and parents about where we are uh, with respect to the Common Core and really with respect to college and career readiness. Uh, but lower proficiency scores, a lower percentage of threes and fours, does not mean that schools are doing worse or that students have learned less. Uh, what it tells us is where we are against the bar of college and career readiness.